Alright, what's up guys? So, new day. Today, I'm gonna start. Bam. Prepping the engine swap. So, I'm just gonna start taking things apart, getting everything prepared so we can drop the motor, take the rear diffuser off, drain the oil, all that stuff. With the help of Chanty's brother, the original MR2 guru. Right here, right here. Sup, sup. He's yeah. the original OG master. We got Winnie here. And that's cute lady. Look at her. But yeah. Gang gang, let's go. The master mechanic. Oh, just got the uh, engine lid off. It's easy access. I'm about to take off the intake. And just start taking yourself apart. Really. So, see you soon. What's up guys? Uh, so right now um, we're just prepping everything for the engine drop. Um, we're just pretty much taking off all the uh, uh, engine harness. Um, already got the wire disconnected from the, uh, the fuse box. And now we're gonna disconnect the wire from the ECU. And yeah. Alright guys, so we pretty much disconnected a bunch of stuff. Uh, honestly, we're coming down to the conclusion of just going to go ahead and drop the motor today. Um, if I can get the cherry picker fixed because it kind of leans a bit to one side. So right now, we're going to go ahead and jack up the car and get the uh, front a little bit more lower than the rear. So we can drain the coolant because it's like gravity. So we're going to get that, drain the coolant, and uh, maybe drain the oil depending on how much uh, capacity we have left in the container. And then that's pretty much it. And then start um, taking a little bit more other stuff out, like maybe the cross member. But we have to do that. And then I guess we'll drop the motor today. So pretty much turbo turbo built coming soon. Or turbo swap coming soon. All right, so we got the car jacked up. As you can see, uh, another thing, take your side skirts off. Don't keep the side skirts on. Especially the Degrady ones, like like in my car, I have like the uh, Aero Air one, and it's fine, but this car, you have like that much space before it hits the pinch well, so it pretty much cracks cracks the side skirt, but only at the bottom. So take your side skirts off when you're jacking up on all four. But right now, we're gonna go ahead and take off the rear diffuser. Um, this car is no longer gonna run this anymore. It's gonna run a different style. Uh, and we're not, we're gonna go ahead, I guess, continue the process of draining the coolant and go from there. What up guys, so we pretty much continued with um, getting everything out. Coolant is drained. I got the fuel line disconnected from the fuel filter. Uh, got all the coolant lines off. So now we got one dilemma as far as the, the AC, either take off the AC line or you know, crack it open and let it run out. And uh, Get the shifter cables off. That's pretty much it. Um, none left to get this off except drop the cross member uh, and then get the motor bounce off and then go pick up the cherry picker, pick up a, uh, a dolly. That's it. And drop it out and ready to go. And then we can start prepping the engine bay, like make it super fresh, clean it up, and stuff like that, power wash it. But you know, obviously, that'll be in the later videos. We done. We done. Sponsored by uh, Harbor Freight, right here. You know what I'm saying? Harbor Freight swap. Harbor Freight swap. My boys. So, right, guys. So, uh, we're pretty much on the verge of uh, dropping the motor. Um, now we're just gonna go ahead and drop the cross member, and then after we get the cross member down, we're gonna take off the front motor mount, and then all we have left is the both side, the both side uh, motor mounts. And then we're gonna take the cherry picker to uh, lower the motor. And then once we lower the motor on onto the dolly, we're gonna take the cherry picker and tie it to the uh, I guess what are those the tow hooks. And then lift the car up, and then pretty much just yank the motor out to the side or somewhere. But yeah, so motor is coming out today. Stay tuned. <coughs> I'm gonna take all the car. 
All right, what's up, guys? So, got the rear cross number down. The axles pulled out. Yep. So now we just gotta put. Uh, oh my, I gotta fix the tray breaker because it's kind of leaning. So from there, then we're gonna put it here. Jack it up. We're not jack it up. Get it nice and tight so we can get the um the side, side motor mounts loose or off completely, and then drop the motor onto our little dolly here. And that's it. And then put it down, jack the car up. Um, crank and pull. So yeah, do not go on the I gotta check up here. Yeah, you know this thing has that pressure. Plus pressure. Hmm? It's like all the way at the end, but I don't want to get there. Oh, shit. Keep going. You said what? You kind of move this way, so should I move the dolly? Yeah, adjust it. Just do it now, though. Okay. Yeah, you just do it now. Yeah. Alright. I gotta take my time on this. Don't. I gotta shift the point. Okay, good. Kevin, do you need to readjust or are you good? Uh, check on the side too, not just that side, Kevin. Both sides. Everything looks like it's good though. Nothing uh, snagging or anything. Are you ready? Let me know if I gotta like pull it to the left, right. All right, go ahead, Take your time. All right, I think the transmission is about to touch. Okay. But you can drop it some more. Um, I'll tell you when you need to adjust. There you go. I got it. That's complete. Is it sitting on it already? Oh, hold on, hold on. The it's sitting on something. The chain thing is on this side. Yeah. Coming up. No, 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 don't worry about it. That's good. Yeah, it's good. Is it on a dolly? Yeah. 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 Oh, look at the hang. It yeah. just stopped. All right. Cool. Wait. That's it. Yeah. So. I'll, I'll hook. I'll hook on it. Yeah. 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 Yeah.